everybody the test bench is done it's up and running we got it working if you've been following me before you'll know that the this is a test bench that I built out of an old server chassis and the base of an old 3d printer so it's a bit of a DIY project and we've got it up and running it's got a motherboard on it now and we can get it booted up in this video I'm going to show you a bit of a tour around the uh, unit and what I've put into it so you can see the unit We've got the base from the old 3D printer all mocked up now, housing the power supply underneath. That's an XFX XT550 power supply. It's got all the cabling that we need, more than powerful enough to run this motherboard and things that I'm going to be testing on it. We've got the 3D printed power switches, which do work. We've got power, reset, and the indicator lights. And we've got, from another video that I did, the speaker that we put on there for the motherboard so that we can get notifications. Up top, we run in an Ace Rock motherboard, an M2 drive, a Ryzen 3 3200G, so it's got integrated graphics, so I don't need nothing else extra on there. We run in 16 gig RAM, two eights of XPG, that is RGB memory, so it looks pretty cool when it comes on and we can adjust it to whatever we need. Overall, it was working pretty well. We've done some braiding on our cables to just tidy everything up, ignoring the mess underneath. We need to sort that out at some point and it's really easily accessible we can just plug anything we need in and it's always up and running so we're going to get some good tests off this i've already tested one of the graphics cards that i've managed to get hold of there's another video on that so make sure you subscribe to this channel if you want to see more and we'll just give a demo of it coming on and that's it so it's all booted up I was booting up, got it running on our Apple Cinema display, old but gold, and there it is. Like I say, if you want to learn more and see more about the things that we're doing on this build, things that we're going to be benchmarking on it, just subscribe to this channel and you'll get the latest updates. <laughs>